Here's Velas. Velas breaking towards the box. Amaya now to distribute. Both teams really committing nicely to the attack, aren't they? They're getting yep. numbers forward, quickly brought sides. Cross is in play. Headed towards frame, and Boutron trying to keep it out of the net. He can't. Go, Colombia. Go, Renteria. It's Moreno who starts this. Well, perhaps doesn't start it, but he provides the real telling header that Boutron cannot deal with. And Renteria, as Johnny on the spot, capitalizes. It's a good ball in to Peru's danger area. And it's well challenged by the Colombians. Arantia well, is who gets the final golden touch. But I think when we see a replay, and he's looking at it in replay, he sees Marino pounce on it with one header. He has a nicely flighted ball in. It's not dealt with by the Peruvians. It's well won here. Maybe a shoulder, but then Marino gets a little bit of a touch, and then it falls to Arantia. Moreno sure to get out of the way. He would have been off sides if he made contact. Castellon it was that went up and left Warrior Lake to win it upstairs. He didn't get a clean, clean header on it, Kelly, either. There's Acaciente and Prado in the back. Hidalgo, Hayo, Solano, and Aguirre in the midfield. And, of course, the striker tandem of Guerrero and Captain Claudio Pizarro. Good ball. Would be a poisonous ball to the back side of the six. Settled just on the chalk line. Back inside, the equalizer is there. This is a tremendous ball back across the face of goal. If I'm not mistaken, it's Solano who volleys this one, triggers it back in. And again, it's not the prettiest goal, but this was a bright start by Kimo's team out of the locker room. And it's that man again, we're just singing his praises a little earlier. Vargas really does well to latch onto this. But when we see it again, excuse me, Guerrera, when you see this again, falls to Nobby on the back. It's one touch, he brings it down beautifully. And it's a great ball across. And he bundles it into the goal, stabs it home in the end. Guerrero, he'll take them any way he likes, any way he can, but that's beautiful technique by the ex-Magpie Newcastle United man, of course. Nobby puts it on a silver plate. Actually, Guerrero, after that really good start in the second half, pulled this game square, but credit. The Colombians now have come, played them way back in since the substitutions count as a good ball. Hit first time on its way to no. the cross. No. no. Oh, what's the referee giving? He's given the goal. He's looking at his assistant, and his assistant has run straight back to the line. A halfway line signifying a goal very close. There's a beautiful ball over the top, and it's stabbed over Boutron. There's all sorts of commotions going on. Spitting the verbals at the referee's assistance, Peru. He's kept onside, he's definitely level. It's a nice touch over. Let's have a look at this. I'm not so sure. Ooh. Is the entire ball over the entire line? You're not going to be able to tell from this angle. The last angle is probably the best one. No way of knowing from that angle. The first one, certainly a good amount of the ball passed over the lane. Right. That's indisputable. But what is always going to be disputable was the entire. Last throw of the dice. Fourth bit of the stoppage time. Looking for an equalizer. The box is out of the picture. They have it. Peru has tied it up in the 94th minute. Guerrero has his second of the game. Perhaps justice is served. 2-2. Fair result at the end of the day. Again, 
It has much to do with good fortune, his pure skill and ability. Guerrero attacks this hopeful ball that's just pumped in. Hopefully, into the box of Colombia. Zapata stares and doesn't come for it. He doesn't claim it. He comes to try to fist it. He misses the ball. There you see again. Just get it into the mixer at this point. Again, snap, crackle, pop. The goalkeeper came here. Have a look. Zapata comes, leaps, misses it. And there you go. It's all downhill after that. Got to be held on the head of the Colombian goalkeeper, I'm afraid to say. Because it should have been the goalies. Tough one to deal with. But that's pure number nine. Predator box assassin. Pounces. All tied up. There's the whistle. There's your game.